Welcome to Facebook Ads Friday week 10. So we are on week 10, which is awesome. If you're new here, then every single week I show you two very successful Facebook ads. So these are Facebook ads which are currently selling drop shipping products. They've got millions of views, thousands of comments. However, the best thing about each of these Facebook ads is they're all still current and active. So every single week you get to see two tried and tested proven products that are selling right now. So not only do you get to see a winning product, you get to see a winning Facebook ad creative that you can use as inspiration. I will also show you where to go to source these products from so you can see exactly what to buy the products for, what to sell the products for, so you know exactly what's left in the middle for your profit margin. And I will also show you what the store looks like selling these products as well. So you have a winning product, a winning Facebook ad creative, a winning supplier, and a winning Shopify store. Essentially all of the inner workings and makeup of a successful business that you can use to create your very own. So with that being said, thanks for tuning in. If you wanna be here for next week, make sure you hit that subscribe button. And of course, if you enjoyed the video, make sure you hit that like button so we can reach and help more people. And that being said, let's take a look at Facebook ad creative number one. This is creative number one then, it's from a company called Clip Rain. It's quite an interesting creative actually. It's not a very typical format or kind of strategy you see many stores using. I think the reason why they've done this before, I'm just gonna pause it for a second and have these two images on the top right, is because they're quite striking images. Obviously this person has quite a happy, expressive facial expression. On the bottom right, it's almost a bit sinister. It looks like a kind of balaclava, somebody hiding their face. And then on the left-hand side, they actually show the video of the products, how it works, what it does, how you use it, so on and so forth. So an interesting strategy, but it goes without saying effective nonetheless. So who am I to argue with it? If it works, then it works. Another reason why I want to show this product, not only is it super successful, um, but it's a great product for right now. So I'm based in the UK, if you haven't guessed already, with it being November, it's really cold over here. People are having to go about their lives and cope with the cold. So they're having to commute in the cold. They're having to walk their dog in the cold. If they walk to the shop or the bus stop, they're having to do this in the cold and a product like this is great for this time of year. And this is backed up by what people are saying. So we can see 10,000 engagements, 1,200 comments, and two and a half thousand shares almost. A post like this doesn't get this level of engagement unless somebody spent a considerable amount of money of it, amount of money on it, and nobody spends money on something unless they're seeing a return on it. Um, so if we take a look at the comments, we can see this is a great idea. Great idea, I need one. Great for a windy Canadian winter. So that in itself might tell you where the, the perfect country is to sell this i need this that's awesome yes thank you just what i was looking for perfect i need one i definitely need this got both of my greats and so somebody's ordered two of them that was five weeks ago if we go back to the top and go to newest comments just to make sure people are still commenting on it so three hours one day ago open this up two days two days three days four days three days four days four days so it just goes to show they're still running this ad people are still commenting on it and people are definitely interested in it so this is a supplier found on aliexpress selling the product there are a few different ones out there so definitely do your research contact them see how responsive they are and just pick one um, that suits your needs and where you're going to be selling the product these guys though they're called maco gear and um, they have a 98 percent positive feedback they've been established since 2019 which is a pretty decent amount of time to be honest for the typical aliexpress supplier and they also have above average seller ratings. So in my mind, a decent supplier. Um, and this is the product then. So it's fairly self-explanatory. It's £4.39. That includes free shipping. There's many different applications for this product as well, which is great because it allows you to kind of test lots of different avenues, see which one you get the most and biggest response from. And then you can really double down and focus on that one particular angle. So whether that's snowboarding, skiing, fishing, hiking, walking, camping, there's so many different applications and products like that always do really well, especially on social media platforms like Facebook because you can really narrow down and target by interest so you can make sure you're focusing on those people who are going to have an interest and requirement for this product. As for the Shopify store selling this product, if I had to guess this is probably a Chinese supplier website by the fact that it looks super unprofessional. It's called cliprain.com um, they just have a home and all products. They don't have any contact information or let's take a look at their contact us page actually. So there's not a lot, there's hours of operation and then they have this copy and pasted in from Ireland and the company name is Fidel BT Limited. So it looks a little dodgy to me. 
Um, but it goes without saying, if you have a really good product and really good creative, people are going to buy it. They're going to look past certain things. And because it's only $10, it's not a lot for people to risk, even if it doesn't show up and even if, even if they don't get the product. If it was me, I would definitely build this or incorporate it into either a one product store or kind of like a wintry branded store. So you have a real brand and you come across as more professional and more trustworthy. And therefore you'll definitely be able to make it more of a success. If you wanted kind of like a very quick 60 second strategy of what I would do for products like this, I would also order half a dozen a dozen of these because they're not expensive i reach out to different influencers so fishers um, hikers snowboarders get them to film a bit of content for you and just showing exactly how the product works putting the actual product on and then doing a bit of fishing or doing snowboarding whatever it is just so you have a bit of action in the ad to kind of keep people's eyes on it and then i would run those ads those different creatives in individual ad sets to the individual interests so obviously one for snowboarders one for fishers one for hikers see which one works see which one you get the biggest response from then i would actually rebrand your store to match that particular niche so it could be a one product kind of win winter fishing store or one product winter snowboarding store whatever it may be moving on to product number two is a product in the dog niche it wouldn't be one of my videos if it didn't feature a product from the dog niche if you don't know already i have a lot of experience in the dog niche it's definitely one of my favorite ones it's probably the best niche for social media because of this exact reason there's no better videos online which get more attention than videos of cute dogs doing silly things to show you just how successful this product has been if i draw your attention we'll I'll pan the screen now so you can see 11,000 engagements, 2,000 comments, and 1.7 million views. However, engagements and comments doesn't always equal purchases. So let's take a look at the comments themselves. We can see Patricia received mine today for her Jack Russell Bruno. People love to post pictures of their dogs. If I was going to sell this product, I'd forget anything bigger than like a beagle. I would just target smaller Jack Russell type size breeds. Um, and we'll flip through actually and we'll see kind of like what sort of dog breeds people are buying this for. So Patricia, two days ago, Mary one week ago got two for her dog so she can rotate them, I'm assuming. Um, Gianna, Gina. Um, just received mine for her little guy so another really small dog breed one week ago um, Sue Salt says her dog called Dotty as we can see another small dog breed this was one week ago people are buying this product right now this is a guaranteed winning product in my opinion Mary says she got one one week ago she absolutely loves it it's for her Yorkie um, Teresa's got two of them this was two days ago again for her small breed dog I think she says it's a poodle um, she's commenting about its way I'm not sure why she's doing that but anyway Kimmy said she recently purchased and waiting one week ago so people are 100% buying this product let's take a look at the actual ad creative itself though so a striking thumbnail of a cute dog wearing the products getting rained on let's get rid of this annoying music so this jacket warms shows exactly how the jacket is put on a dog with this kind of harness feature so it kind of encompasses two different things into one product if you like which could be a really big selling point for this product i definitely think though from my experience in a dog niche people like to buy things for their dog if it makes them look cute so that would be my kind of position on a product like this i'd definitely try and advertise that fact a bit more rather than the actual practicality of it this is the product on aliexpress then as we can see the same product Whoops so let's go back on this get rid of the annoying music you can see it has that kind of two layer functional feature um, which makes it super easy to put on actually um, you zip it up then the kind of two um, clips I suppose come over the back of it which is where you would then attach your lead which I'm assuming actually helps with a dog that likes to pull as well so even though it makes your dog look cute and that's definitely one of the selling points it does actually have some practical functionality to it and a unique selling point this video actually features a big dog using the products as well which is interesting however the comments don't lie all of those comments were from people that have small little dog breeds so that would be my exact strategy on Facebook you can target different and individual dog breeds on Facebook so I target things like Westies or Terriers or Jack Russells those sort of dog breeds what's great about this product as well is a super cheap product so five pounds 90 shipping is two pounds and this is 15 day um, on time guarantee so all in all about eight pounds you can definitely sell this for sort of 20 30 pounds in that region let's have a look what these guys are selling it for so this so this is the shopify store which we just saw with the ad creative as we can see the very same product it even has that same badging on it so they haven't actually gone to the extent of private labeling this product which is interesting initial impressions are then a very basic shopify store they do some things quite well i don't really like the name of it to be honest um, they have buttons for the different so even though it says size they've got the variance the wrong way around so size that should say color and then obviously this should say size and there's no size guide 
anywhere to be seen unless we get further down so i definitely have there's a third party app you can get where you can put like a little thing here so where it says in stock ready to ship i really like this by the way i'd have something below this which says size guide with a little kind of like ruler icon that you can click on and then this would actually pop up i don't know why they've gone for a yellow background here either in my eyes it looks a bit vulgar i've got red yellow blue black obviously the white background lots of different colors it's all a bit mishmash i think it could just be tidied up and made to look a bit more professional in my opinion however i can't criticize it too much design is subjective and at the end of the day they're being successful with this store design so who am i to argue it in fact definitely use these guys as inspiration but like i said i think build on this and just tidy it up a little bit more if it was me just a quick note on this size guide i've mentioned it in a previous video but in case you're new here and you want to sell dog products or any products for that instance that comes with a size guide make sure you include a suggested breed in the size guide the amount of people who will be able to come on the website and think i have a jack russell i'm going to go for a large one and the amount of people who will put their phone down or come off their computer go and find a tape measure then find their dog call their dog get it to stand still and measure it then go back onto the computer or back onto their phone find the size they want and order the product it's going to be a night and day difference so make it as slick and easy as possible for people to buy the product there and then and with that being said then guys i'm going to call it there because i've covered pretty much everything for both of these businesses hopefully i've given you some ideas and motivated you to take some action now to get off youtube and start building your business or at least looking at different products that you want to start selling if you want some extra help getting started and kind of like a step-by-step -step action plan make sure you check out my free training it's in the top link in the description down below 100 free you also get 100 free copy of 194 profitable product ideas that you can take advantage of it's a step-by-step -step training that will show you how to go from zero to an up and running business in 21 days if you want to make sure you don't miss next week's episode so every single week you'll get two proven products delivered to your shopify your shopify your youtube dashboard make sure you subscribe to the channel and of course if you've enjoyed the video please do me the favor of dropping a like thanks for watching guys and i'll see you in the next one